Hi you guys, this is the look I'm going to be teaching you guys today. It uh, looks complicated, it's not you guys. We're going to start off with our nail already having its base coat and the bottom color we're going to use is a dusty pink color and I'll make sure to put the names I used in the description box. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to polish our entire nail completely. Trying not to get our cuticle area dirty which is very hard for me because I'm very sloppy but it is possible there you go alright so first thing we did you guys we have to polish our entire nail with a very light pink color doesn't have to be exactly like mine's but I, I'll put the names anyways so that's where we are right now we're gonna turn this fingernail into this fingernail alright next thing we're gonna do is we already polished our nail with the light pink color so next we're gonna use a dark a dark pink color. All right, and what we're going to do with this dark pink color is we're going to do stripes. The stripes you see on the nails. So the next step is to do the stripes. Now we're going to do the first stripe along the middle of our nail. The next stripe we're going to do it let me see if I could put more polish along the side of our nail. And make sure you do the the lines not so thin because we do want them to show the next line we're going to do it on this side and there's our three lines we have our three lines already the next step we're going to do now that we have our lines is we're going to do a side swipe with a black polish just a side swipe this way going up that way just a simple side swipe and here we go. I always make a mess with these black colors. But there you go. The black is on already. Let me wipe my finger down. So now we have the side swipe. The next thing we're going to do, we're going to need a piece of paper. And we're going to glop some black to our paper because what we're going to do is we're going to draw dots along the side of our side swipe and the dots are going to be touching the side swipe and for this we're going to need the thick part of our nail daughter, the fattest part so we're going to dip it in the black and we want to touch the line with our black dot we want to, we're going to draw four dots and you can see we're touching there's our third dot and there's going to be our fourth dot and as you can see they're touching the sideline we did and remember this doesn't have to be perfect you guys because it's freehand next thing we're going to do with our thin part of our nail daughter we're going to dip it in the black and we're going to do a little strand uniting one area to the other so now we're going to unite this dot we made with the next dot this one right here by that little strand. Now we're going to do another one. We're going to unite this dot to the next dot like that with that very thin strand. This dot we're going to unite it to the next dot. It's sort of like a lace except it's a very easy way of doing the lace. So now because we have no dot here but we want to give it a finished look we're going to do something like that let me clean that off right here so there you go that's where we are so far the next thing we're going to do uh oh you guys um, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add our rhinestones can you see can you see I have rhinestones in these areas right here in every dot every dot I made I'm gonna place a rhinestone and I'm gonna place a dark pink rhinestone so we're gonna glob that area with clear polish and these are the smaller rhinestones the 1 mm not the regular 2 mm these are the smaller ones just because I used the smaller dots alright now we're gonna pick our rhinestone and we're gonna place it in our dot. The next one we're going to clop 
that area, our other, our other dot, we're going to dip our toothpick or whatever we're using to pick up our stones. We're going to pick it up. Uh oh, two came. And we're going to place it right in the middle where we made the other dot. Next, we're going to glop the third dot we made. And remember, we made four. And we're going to dip our stick, pick up our stone, and place it right in the middle of our dot. Next, we're going to do the last one. Dot. Next thing we're going to do is dip our stick, pick up our stone, and place it right in the middle. And there you have it. Alright, we have the stones now. We have the little pink stones. The next step, you guys, for this is, you guys can see that I drew a very thin silvery line. It's very thin. And we want it to be very thin uh, because we already have a lot going on. So, but we do want a silver strand. So next thing we're going to do is we're going to do that very thin line. We're going to outline our side swipe. That's all we're doing right now. We're outlining with a thin, thin line our side swipe. And there you go. That's what we did. We're outlining our side swipe. And we're almost done. The next thing we got to do is we're going to glop our piece of paper again, but this time we're going to glop it with the white polish. That's all we have left to do is do the dots. Now we're going to uh, we're, we're going to dot our black area with white dots. This is sort this sort of reminds me of like a circus look. I don't know why because it's got so much going on. It's got stripes, it's got circles. So we're going to dot our black area. Dot our black area. Dot our black area and dot our black area and that's it you guys that's the look all right I hope you guys like it it's not difficult at all it's very easy to do and it's um really attention catching it's really it's a cute look all right you guys and as you guys can see it wasn't hard at all to do I hope you guys like this try it and um I hope that you guys really do try it because it's really fun and it's not it wasn't hard at all all right you guys thanks for watching bye